Hello everyone. Um, you know, if you know how to solder, and if you have some good basic mechanical assembly skills, and you can follow instructions, then you can build a tube amp uh, for a few hundred dollars, maybe five or six hundred, depending on the power output you're looking for. You can uh, build one of these. This happens to be a 10 watt per channel amplifier made by a company out of Washington State, ASUSA. I think that means Antique Sound USA, but I could be wrong. Um, it's a 10 watt per channel kit that I assembled around 15 to 20 years ago. Uh, I think the owner passed away a long time ago and the company shut down, but they really produce some uh, nice, good quality kits for uh, tube audio enthusiasts. Um, so like I said, this is a 10 watt per channel. It uses a uh, push-pull 6 BQ5 output tubes made by Sovtech, uh, 6 EA8 driver phase splitter tubes made by Philips, and a 5V4G rectifier tube, which I think they said you could substitute a 5AR4 slash GZ34, but I'm not 100% sure on that. And they also said you can upgrade it by uh, putting better quality uh, coupling caps in. So let's try out this little amplifier. It only has line level inputs. Um, so you can hook up a CD player, a cell phone, or um, maybe a ceramic phono cartridge uh, could drive it as well. Um, I tried to use my cell phone to drive it with Pandora, but I wasn't able to take this video and uh, have Pandora running at the same time. So I'm using this little Sony Walkman FM radio. So let's power this up. That's pretty large transformers uh, for a 10 watt per channel amplifier. So this is the model A2 by ASUSA out of Washington State. So you can judge by the size of my hand how small this amp is. It's probably around 12 inches wide and maybe about 6 inches deep or so. Um, I have it in a bedroom right now and it has plenty of power for a bedroom uh, at 10 watts per channel. So you might be able to find one of these on an internet auction site for sale. Um, once again, I wish the company was still in business because they did make some nice affordable kits. Uh, I think this was $350 uh, around 15 or 20 years ago, which, which really isn't bad for a fun project and for an amplifier that will last you um, for decades. So, thank you for watching, and this is the ASUSA A10, uh, I'm sorry, model A2, 10 watt per channel, push-pull push amplifier kit. Um, thank you for watching.